Pictograph alphabet, A, B, C. Alphabet A looks very sharp. Let's start. Alphabet A, sharp series. Look at the apex of the alphabet A. It looks very sharp like a thorn. When you touch it, you feel a sharp pain and scream out, ouch. If you are Korean, you will scream out, aia. Voca root number one. Continued. Latin root ache means sharp. Hereunder, you will study various words containing Latin root ache. Acrid. Acetic. Acerbic. Exasperate. Exacerbate. Argument. Acerbate. Acne. Acid. Look at the pointed peak of the alphabet A. When you touch it, you will feel a sharp ache and scream out, ouch. From now, let's start a journey of building your vocabulary. <coughs> vocabulary number 19. Acetic. Acetic acid. Acetic acid has the chemical formula of CH3COOH. Etymology. Acetic. Acetic is derived from Latin root ache, meaning sharp. There are many related words containing this root, such as acacia, acute, acanthus, acid, acerbic, exacerbate, etc. Definition. Of. Or like vinegar, or acetic acid. Acetic acid is a hygroscopic liquid with a vinegar odor. It is colorless but corrosive. It causes severe burns when contacting eyes, skin, respiratory tract. Acetic acid is a byproduct of fermentation and gives vinegar its characteristic odor. Vinegar is about 4-6% acetic acid in water. More concentrated solutions can be found in laboratory use, and pure acetic acid containing only traces of water is known as glacial acetic acid. What is the difference between acetic acid and vinegar? Vinegar contains acetic acid and water. Therefore, somewhat diluted acetic acid is found in vinegar. Other than acetic acid, natural vinegar may contain other compounds like citric acid, tartaric acid, etc. Tartaric acid is highly water-soluble and has a very strong tart taste. Tartaric acid is naturally found in grapes and bananas. It has been reported that tartaric acid to enhance the flavor of grape-flavored and lime-flavored beverages. Citric acid is found naturally in citrus fruits, especially lemons and limes. Because of its acidic, sour-tasting nature, citric acid is predominantly used as a flavoring and preserving agent. Comparison of citric acid and ascorbic acid. Are they same, or different? When people hear vitamin C, they picture citric fruits like lemon, orange, and lime, among other fruits and vegetables. And we all know these fruits and vegetables contain vitamin C and also citric acid which is partly responsible for their sourness. So, it's not uncommon to think that vitamin C and citric acid are the same. Citric acid and vitamin C are very different. Vitamin C is alternatively known as ascorbic acid and it isn't interchangeable with citric acid. Both of these have very different functions. Nonetheless, it's easy to confuse ascorbic acid with citric because their sources are very similar. In fact, citric acid is more acidic than vitamin C but citric acid is an antioxidant. While ascorbic acid is simply a vitamin. Vitamin C is an essential element that is highly beneficial for good health. A human body is incapable of making vitamin C on its own. 
Experts suggest a consumption somewhere between 75 to 120 milligrams every day. Vitamin C is essential for the repair and development of your body. It plays an active role in collagen formation, iron absorption, and a properly functioning immune system. You need vitamin C for the maintenance of your bones, teeth, and cartilage. It also has antioxidant properties, so you'll get protection from free radicals that cause inflammation. You can find vitamin C in different fruits and vegetables like broccoli, kiwi, tomato juice, red cabbage, and pureed vegetables and fruits. Volca root number one. Latin root ache means sharp. Hereunder, you will study various words containing Latin root ache. Ache. Acute. Acacia. Acupuncture. Coelacanth. Pyracanth. Acumen. Acme. Acer. Look at the pointed peak of the alphabet A. When you touch it, you will feel a sharp ache, and scream out, ouch. From now, let's start a journey of building your vocabulary. Let's call it a day. Next time, we will study vocabulary 20 acrid and 21 acrimonious. Stay focused on this channel. See you next time. Thank you. Dedication Above all, my deep thanks go to my Lord, who gave me so powerful and courageous spirit, without which, I couldn't write even the first line of this book. And then, to my better half, Sun Kong, who encouraged me to do what I want to do and always smiled at me, though I didn't make her enjoy a happy life with a smile on her face. Finally, to my daughters, Jimin and Ji Hyun, who gave me support, and sang a praise for me in unison, all the time. Copyright 2022 Kermijal.com, Hoyung Park. All rights reserved. No part of this book may be used or reproduced in any manner whatsoever without the written permission of the author. If you think this video is useful, please subscribe here.